issued by the department I now work for. Well, do you recall substantially what you told him at that time? Yes, sir. Would you tell us what you told him as you recall it? I advised him that he had the right to an attorney, the right to remain silent. Anything that he stated would be used against him in a court of law. And if he had insufficient funds for an attorney, one would be provided if he so desired. I turned the card over and asked him if he understood everything that I had explained to him. He stated that he did. And I also added, having these rights in mind, would you like to talk to us without the presence of an attorney? He stated that he would talk to us. He didn't think the matter was that serious. And did any statements that he made at that time appear to you to be made freely and voluntarily? Yes, sir, they were. Would you relate any conversations that occurred at that time? I asked him where the slot machine was and he stated, it's right over here. He turned around and we followed him to a bar area where the slot machine was. I looked at it and I asked him where the component was, which was a wheel that was missing from the inside. I asked him where that was and he stated that he didn't have it, that a Kenneth Land owned the machine and he comes and collects from the machine and he also took the wheel. I asked him if we could search for the wheel in his house and he stated, sure, go ahead. You could probably get a search warrant anyway. And I added, you can refuse to let us search. You don't have to let us. He was very cooperative and very nice and said, no, go ahead. You can search any room you want. Officer, what led you to the conclusion something was missing from this machine? I don't know too much about slot machines, but I have seen them in Las Vegas before, about six years ago. and. They have little rollers inside of a window that when they match each other, that is when you get the money. And this was missing and that is what I was looking for because I understood that that was an important part or a payoff part that you had to have before the machine would work. In other words, when you looked at this machine in the residence, you didn't observe any such rollers as you call them. Is that correct? Yes, sir. That's correct. Approximately what size opening did you observe to be vacant? Approximately three inches high by four or five inches long, this opening in the glass. And now that is where the appearance of the rollers are with the different diagrams that have drawings like apples, pears, or cowboys, like on top of the slot machine. Sir, at that point, after talking with the defendant, did you then proceed to make a search for the missing part of the machine? Yes, sir. I asked where his bedroom was because I felt that would be the most likely place to look and he pointed it out. And I went to that bedroom. And did you then commence to search the bedroom? Yes, sir, I did. What part of the bedroom did you look in? I went to the dresser drawer first and started at the top and worked my way down. And what, if anything, did you observe upon opening the first drawer? I observed on top of some jewelry, cuff links, and other items, a cigarette.